Hi guys, welcome to the sixth part of creating a static, simple website on um, in uh, using XHTML and CSS. This is for uh, the final project of the XHTML chapter. Let's proceed with our um, with our code. So we have created now almost everything. We only need to change a few little things in the main page. Uh, so, for example, I want to center the these um, these words here, the home, the about, and the contact in the middle. So let's do that. Let's open the CSS. I just found that uh, as long as you don't um, delete this, uh, even if you take out the CSS um, live CSS editor, when you open it again, everything is there. So uh, it's pretty pretty useful. Um, now uh, what I want to do is uh, to center the text to do that sorry not the text the words to do that I have to go to uh, here in the index.html and you'll see that uh, we have these uh, wrap, wrapped by h3 uh, tags okay so they are h3 um, headers, uh, contact about and home. Now let's grab the h3 in here and to do that uh, let's type um, wrapper uh, table 1 td and h3 uh, now here what I'm going to do is text a line center and there it is okay I'm also I want also to give a font family and Pristina okay and I can also give it a font size a little bit more um, a little bit bigger so let's give it a 15 pixel no more 18 pixels font size 18 pixels oops sorry 18 pixels 20 pixels okay so give it a, f a 20 pixel size and uh, I think that's it that's uh, good enough yes okay um, now the next thing is uh, I'm gonna take all these lines out as well as you see all these uh, borders so let me just go to take one by one so we have a border where we have a border in here header we can take that out have a border in the wrapper you can take that out as well in the main as well uh, the footer uh, let's leave just a border border top and here is um, border top and here let's give it a gray okay and what else uh, I think we are done table okay so um, now what we have to do is copy all this once again go to your style.css and after the body selector paste it all there save it go back refresh this and there it is okay now um, let's just give a little border here to the main image the main image is uh, let me check the main image is here 
let's give it a border of one pixel solid gray okay and there it is you can see it already now down here let's give a padding here to the um, to this where is it padding down here let's instead of a padding let's give it a, a line break here so if you go here and refresh there it is perfect okay okay uh, we are done uh, with the first page now what we want to do is to create the uh, about page and the contact page um, now to do that very simple let's grab pretty much the let's copy everything that is in the index.html uh, and let's put it here and let's save this in your project folder and let's save it as about dot uh, HTML and uh, up here let's type here let's type about um, let's take the table out we don't need the table and let's take the image out and here you can type uh, h3 h3 and type uh, about page okay save it and let's create another one now you can copy everything that is inside the about page and copy to this new file paste it save it and let's call this the um, contact dot html page and here you can change this to contact save it and here just change this to contact okay now if we refresh this we still don't have the the border and the style because I didn't copy that. Uh, the border is in. Okay, let's go here uh, to the style.css and let's just uh, put the border in the image, which is in here. Border one pixel solid gray. Okay and refresh okay we're done now if we click about we'll go to the about page if we click contact we'll go to the contact page now if we click home again we have an error because this is not home it's index so we have to change here index.html and the contact.html and in the about.html we have to change this as well index.html and in here as well okay now down here everything seems to be okay let me just go here okay um, what I'm gonna do is we I have I have uh, I already clicked the uh, home about in contact that's why they are in white so to change that let's go to style.css and let's go to the um, visited here and let's type here black 
active you can type here black as well okay so if we refresh um, we hover it and nothing happens because okay because we have to change it probably in the CSS as well in here so hover is white visited is uh, black active is black okay okay refresh and uh, we're still let me check if I go contact contact about and home okay guys so I found why it's not working the hover uh, because we have to put the ULLIA okay so this is the full path to the uh, anchor um, and now you'll see if I change this it works okay so in here we should also put the UL LI and in here UL LI as well so okay let's copy all this copy and put this in the style.css right after body uh, paste it and that's it okay so we are done with the page um, if you have any questions at all uh, you can send me a private message or post your uh, questions in the comment section okay so I will answer answer them uh, as soon as possible and um, see you guys in the next chapter uh, so if you have also any uh, projects that you are creating and need help I can also have help you uh, with that uh, with uh, any suggestions and that's basically it see you guys in the next video bye